Hey you, let's go over infant hips. Anatomy real quick. Uh, coronal view, neonatal infant hip. Here's your ilium going into the acetabulum right there. This hypoechoic part is a triradiate cartilage. Here's your ischium. That's the femoral head. You can see it's a ball. This echogenic portion is your labrum. This is an excellent view to get your measurements. You want at least 50% coverage of the femoral head. Okay, so using your ilium as a baseline right there, and then your acetabulum, you get your alpha angle. You want your alpha angle to be 60 degrees or above. And babies that are newborn, uh, zero to three months, if their alpha angle is 50 to 60 degrees, it's still considered normal, it's physiologically immature. That's a type 2A hip. A type 1 hip is 60 degrees or more. If the baby's greater than three months and their alpha angle is 50 to 60 degrees, then it's a type 2B. In a hip that's deficient or dysplastic, this angle here will be much shallower and then the femoral head will be higher with less acetabular coverage.